Hey everybody, Coach Kyle here coming at you today. We're going to talk about pressurization and alignment or structure. If you followed us for a while or been to one of our seminars, you've probably seen or heard us talk about soda can analogy. This soda can is going to represent the trunk or the midsection and its ability to support load as hopefully will show well. So in this can, you can see there's good structure. If it was stacked on top of other cans, they could probably support pretty good weight. That's because of the alignment and the structure. As always with us, when we talk bracing and breathing mechanics, we have to highlight the importance of making sure that alignment is there. Now in our can, it already has good structure and alignment. It's not dented or crumpled in any one way. So we can take that out of the equation. The only difference between these two cans is one is open and one is sealed. This has all of its contents in it. This one's empty. <clears throat> We're going to talk about the can as our brace. The structure of this can is like my brace, but it's missing the air or the finish of our intra-abdominal pressure. This can is sealed. It has the brace, the structure, and it's full it'll support more weight. So when we're talking the squat, we're going to show simply the difference of whether you have a brace finished well with intra-abdominal pressure or are you just bracing and you're missing part of your pressure. Once again, same exact cans. This one here has the alignment, has a good brace, and in our terms, it would be finished properly with intra-abdominal pressure. As long as I don't fall over here, you can see that it'll support my full weight. Only difference, structure, alignment, bracing, but it's not completely full with intra-abdominal pressure. And it will not most likely support my weight. I'll try to come straight down on here, and I can't even begin to get all of my weight. So, really important if you have a back injury, or if you would like to prevent back injuries, but just something for you to consider. Do you want your spine to look like this after you train heavy or this? Pay attention to your breathing and bracing.